How you guys doing? This is Johnny back here at MyMixEngineer.com and I am glad to bring to you my first impression of the new Batch Commander 2.5 along with their remote control application that you can find on iOS and I want to say Android but anyway thank you guys Thanks to the team at Slate Digital, they actually listen to the the consumer. And the most thing on forums I've seen was people saying, "I wish the buttons were a little bigger." And they answered that prayer. They answered that prayer definitely, and they added some new presets that made it easier for you to find things. And yeah, the learning curve is short now. It was a, it at first for me it was a big learning curve, but it's very short now. Very, and for anybody new to this, it's going to be very short. Um, as you can see at the bottom, bigger buttons, easier to read text. They also included this tab feature, what is the tab here, which makes it visually pleasing and makes it easier for when you glance down to the bottom of your screen, to the batch commander, that you can see where you want to go or where your button would be. So and it, it comes with so many great batch commands uh, and so many uh some presets that I would say that's very very useful as well as they have different layout default layouts they I'm on the basic one right now they have one for mastering and they have four different scenes in there they also have one for music no I'm not don't want to save it um, and they have eight scenes here don't want to go through all of them and they have one for post and they also have eight scenes here as well All right. So anyway, as you can see, they made this very pleasing on the eye. Very easy for you to glance down and visually, 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 I'm country, you guys got to work with me. Uh, visually, it is pleasing on the eyes. And I really say thank you again. It's, it looks magnificent. And it doesn't take up much real estate on the bottom of your screen. So that's another big plus about it. Also, if I can, I'm going to open up my preset here. There we go. Some of the, the batch commands that I actually use daily. <laughs> I, I love these. But anyway, what I brought this up for is to show you the remote control app. As you can see here, if you can see it, yeah, you should be able to see it. As you can see, the app is very visually pleasing as well. And I'm running it on a, um, what's this, a um, iPad mini. So, as you can see, my iPad mini, and it's very visual. I can see everything, even from where I'm, I'm sitting, at least maybe, I don't, I don't know. I'm a half an arm length and I'm six foot tall, so half an arm length. So anyway, it's pretty close, but not that close. Anyway, so in and it's easy, and all you have to do is just make sure that your computer is linked up to the same network as your lap. I mean, as your iPad or your telephone. Also, I can show you my telephone. Let's see. I have the app on my telephone as well. I bring that in here. Let's see. see it's on my telephone as well I hope you guys can see it but yeah it's on my telephone as well which is easy I can add a new mo mono track as you can see on the screen there it is let's say I want to add a couple stereo audio tracks voila 
Um, oh, wow. That's something I did not know was swiping. So I didn't, swiping it would actually get to go to different clips. Um, which is actually pretty nice. This is my telephone. So hope nobody, hope no one, hope no one calls, but, and let's see, let's add, um, those tracks. I'm going to delete those selected tracks. Delete. Now, there's no way that I'm doing it. Here's both of my hands, you guys. So, the, I'm not messing with the mouse is here. But anyway, wow, I didn't know that you could swipe it on the phone. That's something new. But anyway, on the iPad, it's the same way. Say, for instance, if it was a different region, I mean, different scenes that I would like to do. But I don't have anything on these personally. And the cool thing about this is, let's pull this right back right here for you. All right. So a cool thing is if I change my layout, it automatically changes everywhere else. Cool, right? Cool. It changed. Even if I change the window here, it doesn't change anywhere else. So I can change the windows here. It's pretty dope. That's the word to say, dope. But yeah, you guys, so swing on over to, swing on over, let me stop playing. So again, swing over to bat, swing over to Slate Digital. I have the link in the description. This is a must try. So, give it a try. If you like it, make sure you swing back over here to this video and say, hey, Johnny, you're the man. Not just playing, you guys. No, for real. Do that for real. Tell me I'm the man. No, I'm just joking. All right. So, yeah. Just remember, you guys. Mixing is an art. Be you. Stay true. I'm out. Well, I ain't out. I'm still here, but you know. <gasps> Oops. Hey. Ha, 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 ha